M0 FXP Handtech. Welcome back to the channel. So you can see Droid Star working on my T320. Now I, I don't recommend you download this from the Play Store. I'm connected via a program called Total Control to my T320. I'll just show you where to download that. And you can also use a program called Visor. So there's Total Control. Just download it and it opens up and it looks like this actually. And it just, it will add the APK stroke app to your Android device, you know, to your T320 and many other devices automatically. Um, and then it will just connect and you can control it on here. What you're seeing here on the left side here is basically my T320, which you're seeing just here. And you can, if you want to use your PC, I can TX using, I can make all the, you know, basically do everything that you can do on the device using my PC. But the main thing here is that the APK that I've downloaded, which I have put on my Facebook page just here. Now it's an older APK, but the good thing is it's got the vocoder built into it. Now this isn't going to work on all your, every single device. This is on a T320, it's an older device, this particular APK. So you can see the file name is droidstar.1.0 APK, APK, pure APK. So go to my Facebook page, which is called Ham Radio and Scanner Diary. Okay, and then just look for, go to the file section. So, if, and it's one of the recent posts as well. I might tag it to the top anyway. Uh, let's go to files. You'll just see here on the right, it says files, look files. And it should be one of the recent ones. And I've also put it on the Droid Star page. And I'm going to put a direct link to the APK, this thing here, where there's a whole list of old Droid Star. And you can see it's working great. So let's see if we can go on whilst we're tinkering. Let's see if we can get on to C4FM. I'll use the, the PC because it's a lot easier to do that. The nice thing about this vocoder that I've got, or this Droid Star APK, is that we don't need to add the vocoder because normally you'd have to add the vocoder. You go to settings down to the bottom here and you have to add the vocoder, but this one you don't have to. Okay, so let's go to let's update the hosts and update the DMRDs just by double clicking these two here let's disconnect and then we'll see if we can get we'll click disconnect there and we're going to see if we can select I know the writing isn't very clear but look you've got P25 NXDN let's try and find a reflector and then we'll try and find something like one Charlie, which, oh my God, that's a long list. I know the, the imagery isn't very clear, but if you find one Charlie. All right, it's, my eyesight is so bad, I've decided to try fusion. One, two, test, test. So, you know, on the T320, it's really hard to see, but I think I'll leave it as that. You get the idea, you get the APK, Drag it on using visor. And the way you drag an APK using visor. Oh, someone's just come through on uh, Fusion. XCB, yeah, it's Droid Star on an old T320, and um, yeah, it's been a while. Yeah, I do go on Hubnet every day. I just think talk to the people that you like and ignore the ones you don't. But uh, I am making a video of doing this, so uh, I'll chuck it back to you, and hope you're keeping well. De it's Des, isn't it? 
and Droid Star's working fine for you, but I'm not sure how good my audio is. I'm coming in via YSF uh, CQNW UK, it says. Back to you. There you are, that's working well on Fusion. Okay, if you're making a video, let me just clear my throat. Yeah, okay, well, I'll be, uh, I'll be quite honest with you. Uh, you're coming through via YSF, not the YSX port. It's, it's fully readable, don't get me wrong. It's not brilliant or perfect audio. The YSF, D-Star, DMR, it all works. So let's show you how to drag it on. We've got a big PTT there as well. Look for TX. Yeah, no problem. Well, I haven't had a chance to even go into the sort of mic gain settings. I managed to find an APK that will go straight onto my Enrico T320, which, as you know, is a old, old, very old Android, Android 7, I think, um, with the vocoder, as they call it, built in. So that's what I'm tinkering with, and, and that's what the video is all about, how to get your T320 and go on to DMRD Star Fusion using Droid Star without the hassle of loading up the vocoder. So thanks for watching, uh, my, my, sorry, thanks for uh, calling me. I'm just going to finish up this video, and I'll post it in about 10 minutes. It will be on my M0FXB YouTube channel, Des. So uh, back to you, and uh, thanks for coming back to me. You see, it just works okay, doesn't it? Works fine, doesn't it? Is it? It's all, all going on today. I will say, if you update the APK, if you update it, it might stop working. So to drag the file in, I just, you've got, got it here on my, see it there? Let me just do it so you can see it a minute. Move some of this items. Right, so download file there. Right click on the file, go to show in folder, and you've got all your files that show up here. So that's the, AP, the APK one that I've just been using is, uh, let's find it, the correct one. Uh, there is that droid star 1.0 ap you literally just and I've, i'm not going to do it again because it's here as you can see on the left that's my actual t320 click on it and drag across and let go this is using total control and it will just load it for you and then all i had to do was go in and add my call sign which i'll show you now So we go to settings, look, call sign, DMR number, and I've got a password for Brandmeister. I haven't really used the log because that keeps coming up. I'm not sure what that means. Um, and anyway, don't forget it's an older one. And then that's that. And then basically here, select the mode. So say we want to do DMR. And there's my Brandmeister 231. I'm going on to talk group 91. Hit connect. And um, there you are. And that's basically my T320 that you can see there. Bye for now. All the links in the description. 73.